Hello and welcome back as we begin our first part of this mission, detaching from the Space Corps 1. There we go, we are in doubt. Here we go as we attempt to re-enter orbit and land before moving on to the rendezvous and docking of the new module. Enjoy. And here we go, still a ways off, but we are on our approach, and all is still looking okay as we start to enter atmospheric burn. This will be Jebediah's fourth time in space now. He was commander of the Space Corps 1 while he was up there, being first to test it. And he will be back on Earth with his family for a few months. And then he will be going back up on one of the future missions. And beginning our approach, still on our way, and our goal is to land back at the same launch pad that we took off from. So far, our flight trajectory is all clear, and we will keep you up to date as we go on. And we didn't put our solar panels away, 
so they are being busted off, but that is okay. As this craft will not be re-entering space, not this one. And it just needs to get them safely back to, I presume, somewhere over here on the other side of these mountains. Oh, yeah, I think I see it there. Our target up in the distance over here. And we are now approaching our target. Still a ways off, but just crossing over the mountains. Jebediah looking somber, and I'm sure he'll be relieved to be on ground. He's starting to get a little excited. He sees the facilities in the horizon there. And we will be landing in a couple minutes. And we are beginning to tumble. And hopefully this will help drop some of that speed as we enter the atmosphere a little bit quicker. And it's trying to re-stabilize itself. As we come through the layers of curved atmosphere. And we are now deploying the legs and using them as a brake system to help slow us down as we approach our final target here. And they seem to be working, slowing the craft down quite a bit as we enter our final approach. And it looks like we're going to be just a little bit off of our landing. But that's not bad. Pretty, pretty close. And we're getting close to our final touchdown, and our chutes will be widening out soon. Which will drop our speed down the rest of the way at which point she will glide back down 
and touch down on ground. And there it is. The chutes have released. And a little bit of engine burn. Helps slow everything down. And we can turn that off now. And Chebediah looking slightly concerned still, but I'm sure he's very happy to be so close to home. Landing almost back where they needed to. Just a few, just a good car ride away from the facilities. Uh, I think he was hoping for a hole-in-one. And a look in the cockpit as we get closer to ground here. And Jebediah very much ready to be back on land. Now shutting off the engines. And the final seconds before touchdown now. And our speed is looking good. Jebediah is still looking slightly concerned, but you can tell that he's starting to be relieved a little bit. He's a little 50-50, and it all looks like it's going to be a smooth landing from the Spaceport 1 as we retire this model that was aboard the space station. And of course it did its job well, though it only was used this one time, other than tests. It brought Jebediah home safe as we make room for a newer model. Next on our mission, we will now be talking the EH and A module in the exact same spot that that was just docked in. So stay tuned for more. <laughs>